Hi, this is Christophe Impecietti for Bistech and welcome to this short educational video in which we are going to discuss how to display prompt selection when we generate a PDF output. For this we are going to need a report with a prompt, a render variable and finally a report studio function. So first let's discuss the problem we're having with a prompt in a report. You see here we have a list report with a prompt and when I select the year 2013 I see the numbers I'm interested in but when I switch to a PDF display the value I've selected for the prompt is not showing. So in order to display the value of the prompt in a PDF output we need to do two things. First of all I'm gonna go in the toolbox and I'm gonna drag a layout calculation after the prompt right here and in this layout calculation I will click the last tab, the parameters tab and drag the value of my prompt in the expression definition and I just click OK. So this layout calculation I just dragged in my report will display the value of my prompt but I only want to display this value when I'm gonna use a PDF output so I click this layout calculation, go in my properties window, select render variable click the ellipsis, create a new string variable that I'm gonna call output, I can call it whatever I want, click the new uh, value button, add, and type PDF. I click OK, click OK a second time, the expression window pops up automatically, I click the function tab and I'm gonna use a function called report output report output, I'll drag it in my expression definition, we'll test which report output I am generating. I'm just gonna click the validate button and I'm gonna click OK and I'm gonna click OK again. So this is it, that's all you have to do. I'm going to summarize the situation. So we've been using a layout calculation that I've placed right next to my prompt here in my report and this value is conditionally displayed using a render variable called output. And if I'm going in the Condition Explorer to show you that variable, I can double click it and show you that we are using a function called Report Output. And this function is testing a value PDF, which means we are using a PDF output. And this value will only show if we are using a PDF output. I'm going to run the report to show you what's happening. Maximize this window. We've selected a value, for example, I select 2012 in my report. This is an HTML display, so it's all good. But if I switch to a PDF display now, you can see that now the year is showing in my PDF report. Thank you very much for watching. This was Christophe Impecciati for Bistec. And if you need any assistance in developing uh, Cognos platforms, please give us a call or visit our webpage at bistec.com.au where you will also find additional training videos in our services section. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.